Alright guys, you know the drill. Today we're doing another Zarya VOD review. This is going to be for Alex on PlayStation 4. He is in Master Tier playing Zarya on New Bonnie. Um, if this is your first time watching one of these, I'm Canadian. I do Zarya VOD reviews. Uh, I talk about positioning, ability usage, target selection, all that kind of stuff. Uh, my goal is to try and help people get better at Zarya. I'm a Grandmaster Zarya main myself, about 4,800 or so. Uh, anyways, that's it for me. Let's go ahead and get started with this review. That for us. So, uh, the first thing I want to know, this is, obviously I'm here to help player, people get better at Zarya, so that's fine, but I just want an important note that Winston is so good on the first point of Numbani, either attacking or defending. Just a heads up for everyone. He's amazing. Where are they? Uh, let's look at this. So she saw fair rockets flying through, so I understand why that barrier happened. The other thing, by the way, is you don't have health bars turned on. So you can't actually see if Soldier took damage or if she's just shooting. So if you, like, saw him take a bit of damage, then the shield makes more sense. But since we can't tell, we don't know. Definitely recommendations turn on those allied health bars. Where are they? Sorry, you keep an eye in front, I'll keep an eye on right. Uh, let's so look, look at this personal front, shield. Right. By the way, other thing is the the original source film is a bit grainy, guys. I can't do anything about it, so just bear with me with that. Uh, no one had. Oh, you got the energy from Fire Strike, so it worked out. They have okay. The enemy team is doing Symmetra attack. I just want to make everyone aware. Good bubble there. That was beautiful. You're waiting. You're holding it, waiting for the uh, inevitable Good charge. Line, huh? So that was a really good discipline there. And by the way, this, you're going to get booped off. This is the issue with Zarya, right? When you get knocked down, you have to go up these stairs to get all the way back up. So you're shielding, so maybe he'll boop and you won't get knocked off. So this is a really good shield. I think, did you shield because you saw Lucio, or that just kind of just happened that way? Uh, I know, you were looking at Hog, but hey, it still wor it worked out. Sorry, if you got a bubble... So, like, so yeah, so you got you Zarya. lost the low ground, and then, you, like, Zarya's just stuck. Where are your healers? Mercy's dead. Uh, oh, Zarya, let's see. I'm trying to see your team comp here. Oh, you have Mercy Symmetra, so once Mercy's dead, there's no healers. I'm trying to see if there's anything else you could have done here. Line, huh? You guys get this kill on the Rhine, and then you're trying to go Zarya, back to the point, but... Yeah, I mean, you played that as well as you could. Lucio can still boop you with bubble now? No, he okay. cannot. Bubble there, you're you're kind of you're playing this poke phase really well. Uh, where was your other projected barrier? Sorry, guys, to go back. Uh, so that's a poke phase barrier, which is fine. Just make sure you see some more damage. Like right here, you see the fire strike and a smetch orb. That's the better poke phase barrier for your Ryan. But you get a good barrier on yourself, but you kind of got no value out of that other one. See, there you go. That was good. You saw a Smetra Orb floating right towards Orion. You used it. So now I would say stop with poke based barriers. One more good barrier from Yuzga to put you at 90 or so. Right? And now you can use your projected barrier specifically to save people instead of for energy. So all that McCree flanking. Oh, see that barrier not necessary. Your soldier just ulted. You should have shielded him. He could be a little more aggressive. You just wasted your own. shield but yeah you're gonna die i don't know what happened to your ryan why did he just he just like he disappeared just okay he's on he's right behind you he's literally right to your he left there you're active why isn't he stepping forward to cover you oh i don't know he died too wow that was awkward so okay all right, let's go back. There, a lot of things happen. My brain's just kind of all over the place. So first thing, we talked about your barriers. In terms of positioning, you're doing a good job playing behind your Ryan. 
but your Ryan needs to, you know, aggress. Your Ryan literally just let them free push this whole way. He never contested the card. So that's the that's the team mistake. But in terms of Zarya play, I mean, I said you shouldn't use. You had one barrier that you probably didn't need on your um, Reinhardt when your soldier ulted. But besides that, all your other barriers were fine. Your positioning was fine. You couldn't really move in because your Ryan was so passive. So you, no, nothing. You played that well for uh, what happened. That was good. You personal shielded and Fair killed herself. That's kind of hilarious. Uh, give me a second, guys. Someone's at the doorbell. All right. Anyway, guys, sorry for the wait. Thanks for that. Uh, th Chilled thanks that. for the interesting uh, combo. Anyways, so personal shield here makes so much or uh, pull that fair kill herself. That's pretty yeah, hilarious and good. And who's saying how are we getting rolled this hard? How yeah, the fuck are we getting rolled? This okay, it's hilarious. Your Reinhardt saying how we're getting rolled this hard when he's the one giving them all the space. You can't be Reinhardt and then just hold the S key. You have to be Reinhardt and press the W key at some point to go into the enemy team. So that's why you're getting rolled, Reinhardt, if you're watching this. We're still running Symmetra. All these... No, Symmetra... Yeah, we can't go for Symmetra was not the problem. But these two heroes are just going to put you guys way behind the alt economy. We have the enemy no team's going to have Graviton, Earthshatter. Right, I think all they used last fight was High Noon. Okay, another thing, why would your Ryan charge out of a grab when he has a shield and they don't have a barrage? Like, that was so silly. Thankfully, no one died, but... They have mercy, don't they? Uh, no, you guys have mercy. Ooh. Are you going to get that kill? Are you going to get it? Oh, no. Okay, let's talk about the scrap. <coughs> no hit Actually, let's talk about no the shield. Scan. So that shield, that's a poke face shield. Okay, the teams are a bit far from we each other. That no one's fine. Scan. Your personal shield, do the same thing with. That one's fine. But, you know, the enemy team, like, and engages... Like, you have this one back, right? So you see that it was okay to use that one shield. So that's fine. I think it's the second shield you do. This one, that's the bad shield. Because now, look at the two teams, right? They're so close to each other. Your first one was okay. This one, not okay. In, in terms of your its usefulness, right? You didn't even get any charge for it. You shield yourself in a grab. That's typical, so that's fine. This Graviton right here... Oh, no, I'm writing on the screen. Oops. This grab, it's your... This is the uh, Graviton, the front line, and win the fight that way type of situation, right? You got... Only the two tanks, which is fine. That's a way to win a fight. You're going to kill them and then have complete access to the rest of the squishy members on the side. You know, whoever that is, Lucio's over here, Farah's in the sky. So, it's a good grab. You had some follow-up, but not too much from your team, but you were able to dish out the damage yourself, so that was good. You almost killed this Farah. What was your other shield here? Uh... Punch, by the way, to go through the shield. That shield's kind of whatever, because the fight's mostly won. Ooh. Nice, you found the shield gen. Oh, why, why would you put it here, Symmetra? That's terrible placement. Can we please... Can one of you guys switch and go hit scan for us? We're getting wrecked by... Um, uh, yeah. Good discipline with your shields. Don't do it. Alright, so this shield again, very selfish shield. It's an I want energy shield when the entire team is right in front of us, so. Nice beam kill there. Shield your Ryan. See, your Ryan is. See, this is fine, right? Your Ryan is in the fight swinging at people, so this shield is different than the one you had before. Shield him, buddy. Shield him! Oh, did it get tossed on someone else on accident? Oh no, it, it got on him. Good job. So far, I think I've seen a lot of good reloads, mostly uh, zero ammo reloads, so that's good. That was a good. That was so. That was like your best fight so far, except for uh, I think you had one shield that was not my favorite. Yeah, that one.
So you're kind of overextending. Uh, you're lucky they didn't really commit on you. But you have no shield now. You have no shield, so you have to back up. You can't keep doing this without shield. I mean, your your mercy's healing you, so maybe that's why you're doing it. So that's so that, that's a, a bit of an there, enabler. Right. Also, again, this shield right here. You have the choice between your shield and your projected shield to get energy. If you have this choice specifically for energy gain, always use yours. This one is way more valuable than this one. Right? Because if you just want energy that's getting hit out Ryan, just use your own shield and walk in front of him. Someone's charging the shit out of there, Zara. See ya, Fizz. Thanks for stopping by, dude. Look, so you just got... Let's look at this, by the way. We went from 80 to 100 energy with two bubbles. That's like, it's so, that is so inefficient. It's completely inefficient. Some okay, look, 99, 100 energy, 100 energy. And then he used another barrier to get three energy. Like, like that's just not good. That's not efficient barrier use. Again, I, I bet you he's going to do it again. I'm, I'm, this is the last time, I swear. I'm just going to point it out once, you know, uh, one more time, and just refer back to it quickly. You know, if he, what's about to happen, he's going to use this shield, I bet, but he should use this one. It comes up in three seconds. In three seconds, you'll decay six energy. He'll be at 80. You can get 40 energy from this. You'll obviously be at 100. Oh, maybe not. Maybe he learned. Uh, there is, yeah. That was a good shield there in case Ryan got charged. Ooh, you kind of whiffed that grab, though. Uh oh So what was the plan here? Let's see. So right here, the moment Ryan charged in like this, you get a good barrier in case your Ryan gets pinned, but he just left his team open for grav. So I want to see... There. Yeah, you wanted to catch like these three, but realistically these two, which would have been the best one. So you want to like hit it right here. Oh, you, I mean, you were aiming right here, right when you pressed it anyway, so it would have been bad. Reinhardt then moved you over with a swing, but, oh, and your own Reinhardt knocked them all back. So that was just unfortunate, like a series of unfortunate events, so that sucks. Yeah, your shields are as good as they could be there, I think. You know, a personal shield to kill this Rein. You do get him, which is actually huge, so now people, your own team... Coming back to the fight, they can dish out damage, right? It's like Zen can kill McCree now because you killed Ryan. So you did a good job with target selection there, right? You're, like, he's in your grab, so you're choosing him. You could have easily picked the Ana to your right or Zarya, but you get the Ryan. He's got Discord, so even better target selection. And now the attacking team has no shield. Your Zen gets a kill, which is nice, and probably stall out this push. Alright. Ooh. Uh oh. Fucking run and she follows. Your mercy has not used res yet, has she? Fucking run and she follows. Your barriers have been pretty good this fight. Good barrier there to save your life. Target selection is like, you know, you can't, there's nothing to shoot really because the the giant shield's in the way. Your Mercy still has res, man. Oh, here it comes, finally. First res, I think, on defense. Good focus here because she's got no personal, no escape. Look, the cart's being contested though, right? So you have to go back to the cart. You can't chase this Lucio, you have to go back to the cart, 100%. I I was just killing everyone. Alright, there you go. I'm glad you turned around. God, your Ryan is being passive aggressive. Which yeah, I can understand. I was definitely passive aggressive in my games a little bit today. Good barrier and good charge. So by the way, the only the just little tidbit here is you had no ammo, so can't really fault you, but if in the future if you can, you know, follow it up with a grenade. But I'm sure you reloaded and then you started to beam, which is a little far, just you know, toss that grenade out. Good job. 
can push her because she has no barrier. Oh. I have a TP or some shit up here. Retreat. They don't have a TP. Gen, it's yeah. a shield gen. He's trying to say ultimate ready and he's hitting voice lines. Kind of funny. Okay, you're so good on energy. Don't barrier your Ryan here for energy. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. <sighs> okay, well, I already talked about it. I'm not going to mention it in depth again. Oh my god. How is your team getting blindsided by this McCree? Good grab, I'm pretty sure. Uh oh. No, kill the Lucio. Okay. So here's why you kill so Lucio. Dies each time that comes mm. No, I don't know actually, because Zarya has barriers, right? Barriers can be really game changing, but Luc Lucio hasn't used sound barrier in a while, so I think he's getting close to it. That's why I'm saying kill him. Oh, that was a great shatter. There, that's what I was. This is exactly. <laughs> look at that. Just like I was talking about, he's getting close to sound barrier, and he and he uses it. So. This game sense right here is why you wanted to kill Lucio in that Graviton. Mercy, all, like, she's already stuck. She has no mobility. She won't get away after this grab. So you can kill, like, he's the nimble one. So if you kill the one that can actually escape, then the one that can escape will just die right after. <laughs> you have no idea what your Ryan's health is at. Ooh, good, uh, you were ready with the barrier, too, so that was two positives. You were, you were there to, uh, with the shield, and you were there to kill him, so good job. So he goes from Genji to window. Your Reinhardt needs to focus on his own play, seriously. Yeah. Is this good actual retarder? Oh my god, I hope you reported him, except there's no report on console. <laughs> I, okay, another thing, again, we already, I already mentioned it, not going to go in depth, but you have options for both shields, basically, one second, and you use the wrong one. You, two things, you use it when the enemy team is right, right there, and it's projected barrier. Just use personal shield for energy. You need to, you need to break that habit there uh, of using your projected barrier specifically for energy gain, especially when you were already at 80 energy. Just use your personal. You, like, you only got 20 energy for that shield. And then that, and then that shield that you just used, you 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 only get, got like five energy from it, but you had to because of your positioning. Uh, okay, uh, another barrier where a fight is about to happen. You're already at like a hundred charge, and you're using another barrier for energy. Like, let me just 94, 92, 91. A uh, 13 charge barrier when the enemy team is right here. Like, uh, and you you had your own barrier in two seconds. If you want energy that badly, just use your personal shield. You, in two seconds, you would have decayed four energy. It's not a big deal. You can just wait the two seconds if you want energy. But you keep using this barrier for energy, and I, I, I need to come up with like a code word. Every time that happens from this point on, I'm just gonna say that barrier is bananas. So the whole concept is explained with one word because. I know I have a bad habit of explaining things over and over and over and over, so I'll try not to do that. Good shields. You had Graviton, so you're, the guy complaining about Widow, and then Widow just like cleaned the fight like crazy. One kill. Two kills. Three kills. So oh, that's funny. Sorry. So after that round, your biggest issue is definitely your projected barriers. You're doing a good job getting energy with your personal shield, but. You're doing a terrible job of of having disciplined projected barriers. You've had some really good projected barriers, you know, helping Ryan engage. Um, but I don't think you you shielded a single teammate that ulted, which I don't actually remember seeing a teammate. I know you yeah, had yeah. a soldier ult yeah. once and you barriered Ryan, but <clears throat> your mainly good barriers were like Ryan charging in. But besides that, there's not really a lot of one-shot opportunity. That's I mean, you buried people inside more. Gravitons and stuff like that, so that was good. But you use your personal shield for energy way too much. Like, I'm amazed that uh, you weren't punished for it that much. But in other games, you will be 100%. Your Gravitons uh, were pretty good. 
Uh, I think one of them you just got knocked over and your Ryan knocked him away, but that was a good idea. So you're, have, you're having good Gravitons. Your positioning is main is actually pretty good. You're just kind of staying with or behind your Ryan. You had a little bit where you overextended too far without personal shield, but your Mercy kind of covered your butt there. Um, so your positioning is overall pretty good. We talked about ability usage. Uh, target selection is actually really good too. You're going, You're all over the enemy tanks as much as you can be, which is great because Zarya just melts tanks, so... <laughs> Good job there. Thanks for sticking around till the end of the video. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button on the right hand side. And if you want to see more videos, check out these two on the left. Again, thank you so much for watching and have a good one.